Get back here! Wait, what? Don't just stand on you idiots, catch him! As they get bulldozed by this huge ass dude with a mustache running for, away from his life, is Izuku just blows past them and is like, uh, what just happened? Shut the fuck up and help me! But, wait, help you? Help me get rid of this brat! Wait, that's not yours? No, you idiots! As they lose him. He just jumps in the river and he's gone. Ziku, he's out of breath. And so are Kaminari and Jiro. Are you kidding me? What, what, can you explain what happened? <sighs> Alright. Uh, after my nap. What? I said after my nap. Got a problem with that. Uh, no, sir. Good way, sir. Huh. You don't look like my usual lackey. What's, what's going on here? Oh, uh, see, uh, my name is Denki Kaminari, and... Um, uh, Denki? Huh. Okay. So, who's this? Oh, this is my best friend, Jiro. It, yeah, I, I'm his friend. Okay. Wait, why are y'all here anyway? Well, the sticky situation. Man, you mean Mineta? Oh, he sent you guys here, huh? Fucking bastard. So what do you want? Well, go ahead and tell him. Tell me what? Because if you're here to jump me, you're waiting a little too late. No, 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 no. no nothing like that. You, you see, I just, um, guess. Speak up and speak clearly. You're pissing me off. <clears throat> well, um, you see, I, I would like to join your group. No, please, no. Why? <sighs> okay, whatever. What's your quirk? Electricity. Already have one of those. I don't need any more lackeys right now. It's a pain in the ass I wasn't able to go to UA. Wait, you wanted to go to the hero school? Yes. <sighs> but I pretty much went a little overboard when it came to the exam. Ended up picking a fight with some rich know-it-all named Tinya Ida. Man, that guy was a prick. All because he went to a fancy middle school. He thinks he's better than me. Uh, um, what? So about my enrollment, huh? All oh, right, you still wanna <sighs> listen, commentary. I don't need no more lackeys and I already have an electricity guy so I definitely don't need you. Goodbye. You think I'm just walking off? Jiro, she snaps at him. And I mean she snaps. She starts to get up all up in his face. She pushes him. Izuku no the game pissed starting to raise his fist but as soon as he goes to sock Jiro Kamen already steps in and protects her why did you do that you're my best friend and I feel obligated to protect you <laughs> you pass huh 
Wait, what do you mean? I pass. Yeah, you see, the way I test my new recruits is really a, a test on marriage as well as the kind of person they are on the inside. Usually they come alone and I'm in the middle of a fight and they're tasked with helping me out. Yeah, but that really doesn't tell me much about a person except since they already know how strong I am. So I let them go through some trials when it comes to, you know. But lucky for you, you have one hell of a woman around you. Yeah. What? Yeah, some people are actually scared of me when it comes to things. Most would even think about putting their hands on me. But this Jiro girl, she's she has uh, she has guts. I like that. I'm not interested in you. Trust me, I'm not interested in you either. Ugh, seriously. I have enough women in my life to... What? Uh, it doesn't matter. Either way... Kaminari... You've shown uh, that you're a pretty good, uh, good dude. And... Yeah... It would be good having someone like you around to watch my ass. Especially when Koski and the others aren't around. <sighs> but as far as boosting your quirk, that you're gonna have to earn. But you said I passed. Yeah, a lot of people want to be around me just in case I, you know, want to give them a extra push. But I don't just hand that like candy. Uh, so, what you're saying is, if I want my quirk boosted, I'm gonna have to prove myself even more. Yeah. Huh. But yeah, I better held back on that punch. What? Oh yeah, that's not my strongest punch. Heck, I just, just in case you were, uh, you could say a nutless prick. I didn't want to end up hurting Jiro too bad. Uh, what? Eh, I wasn't really gonna hurt her that bad. So you actually would have hit me? Yeah. But I'm a girl. <laughs> Wait, wait, what's so funny? Uh, what does you being a girl matter? Uh, Chivalry's dead. No, not completely. Besides, if it is, it's probably women who ruined it. But seriously, just because your girl doesn't mean you can't take a punch. Seriously, I, I could tell that if I went full force. Oh, and actually, I would put anyone in the hospital, but still. Oh, it's called gender equality. Okay. So, yeah, I'm seeing you as more of an equal. <laughs> Saying that, yes, I would hit you. But that was only going to be in self-defense because of a bunch of bullshit. So defense, I didn't even hit you. You shoved me several times, getting all up in my face and not expect any repercussions. Right. Um, sorry about that. No, no. Really, I respect you more for it. No one. <laughs> not many people can really, uh, you know, be as, uh, tough as you. I, I honestly respect that. Just watch out for this idiot. Huh. Idiot? Yeah, I'm talking to you, Dinky. <sighs> now, 
about that nap. As Izuku walks off, just forgetting about, um, excuse me, what is it? There's a baby on your shoulder. Oh crap, I forgot about. <sighs> this is gonna be a pain in the ass to really explain. Huh. Okay, let's see how should I do this? Hey mom, I. Uh, some weird man just dropped this kid off and I don't know what to do with it. It's attached at the hip, it won't let go of me. Huh, yeah, that's not gonna work. No, I'm leaving. Ugh, this is gonna be a pain. Wait, just a second, please. Huh? Who are you? My name is Himiko Toga. Nice to meet you. And, uh, I am the maid. Or at least guardian of that little kid you're carrying. What? Yep. Okay, in that case, here, you take him. He's like trying to pry Belle off of him, but it's not working. Her trying to help, but yeah, he's stuck to you. No shit, Sherlock. Hey, be nice. Or what? Her just taking on a knife and saying, I will cut you. You think I have been cut before? Really? And what about as she's sliding her knife down south? Him like, wait, 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 wait what are you doing? So, if babies are your issue, I can make sure you never have any of your own. <coughs> are you really threatening to cut? Yeah. If you want to have fun with your friends here, you will be, uh, it will be smart for you to, you know, mind your manners. <laughs> crazy. I ain't crazy. Uh, were you a demon? Yeah. Uh, uh, Mr. Midoriya? Was it, Danky? Is she one of your girlfriends? Hell no. I don't know anyone this crazy. But she she seems very attached to that kid, so maybe wait. He has greenish hair like you. And she is blonde. A dirty blonde, but still are you sure? Like, no. No, don't don't finish that sentence. I don't know this woman, she don't know me. Oh wait, I know you. What? Oh yeah, I know about your whole saga, of how you want to be a hero. And I gotta say, it's so touching. Okay, so you're supposed to be his guardian or whatever, maid girl, right? Correct. So, huh, can you explain why that Big mustachio dude just dropped him off. Oh yeah, easy. That's easy. You see, every now and again, the demon lord wants to, you know, destroy all humanity. Yada yada yada. Apocalypse, all that. Okay, I'm following. He's just a terrible father who wants someone else to raise his kids. What? So he's just a lazy dad. Yeah, and bit of what you would call an otaku or a neat to the point where yeah, he's just lazy eating about and not wanting to do much but to goof off. Oh. I feel like I want to beat the shit out of him. Uh, what? Who would just lump their child on someone else's lap? A complete stranger, no less. What if I... What's a complete... Huh. What if I was a complete creep? 
Oh, that's a good point. In that case, I would have castrated you already. <sighs> fair point. Very fair. So, how can I really get this kid to back off of me? You can't. What? Unless you find someone more evil and or stronger than you. But as far as I can tell, no one is stronger than me. Hmm? You can find some villains. But I want to be a hero. And if this kid... Hmm. Ah, crap. I don't want this kid turning out so evil that he'll destroy humanity upon a whim. So what are you suggesting? As much as I might hate it, I'm going to be stuck with this kid until he's grown up. Well, as long as he's a baby. I say as long as when he grows up to be at least a toddler. Maybe in some years. Then you won't have to be so close to him. What do you mean? I was planning on letting my mom watch him while I go to school. That won't work. Why not? You'll die. What? Yeah, if you were too far away from the young master here, you will die. What the? As he just grabs Bill, him looking at him, this thing, this whole thing is going to kill me if I'm too close. Well, too far. Yes. Get rid of him! I'm trying to throw Bill away. Right to Toga. It's not working. And she, slowly, well, surely, he starts crying and lightning rain down, electrocuting Izuku. Him getting hurt, but he heals fast, luckily. What was that? That's what happens when he cries. What? Yeah. No. Nah, 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 nah. That's no, no, don't. No, that's fucked up. Such language in front of a baby. Brute. Yeah. Brute. Brute. <clears throat> Listen. Do you realize? How many times a baby can cry seemingly for nothing? Well, that's your problem, isn't it? But you're his guardian, shouldn't you? Just don't get your pennies in a wad, I don't worry. You won't be raising him alone. <sighs> really? Of course not. I'll be around. Anyway, let's go home. Oh, good, you're taking him in. After all, nope, I'm following you home. What? Yeah, I'm going to have to stay with you to make sure that he's well taken care of. No. Yes. So I'm going to have to be staying with a crazy bitch. Excuse me? <coughs> What'd you call me? <coughs> I... Uh... Don't forget the lives of millions just gesturing towards his crotch. It's like the lives of those millions, trillions possibly, depend on your answer. No, oh, fuck it. I ain't scared. I ain't scared. Yeah, I called you crazy. Her just tackling him. It's like, call me crazy again. She just sliding the knife up and down. It's like, <clears throat> Cuckoo. Her stabbing into his chest, missing his heart purposely as he groans in pain. Dinky and Jiro are... Do you need some help, boss? What you think? Get this crazy bitch off of me. Her continuously stabbing him. He and being able to heal. Him wondering why am I not dead? Is like, oh, it's because the kid is keeping you alive. What? He is he's like, now that you mention, I do feel somewhat weird energy. Oh, yes. He will not let you die. So I can stab you 
and you will heal as much as I need you to. What? <laughs> <laughs>